Hey gang, something happened this past Sunday that I wanted to share with you guys that really just makes me feel like, well, this really makes me kind of feel like that there are just people in this town who, who just plain don't get it. How you doing? <laughs> okay, so this past Sunday I'm going to the library, I'm going to upload one of my videos, and I'm walking down here by the Baptist Church. And this white truck passes by me and pulls up right around that area right there. This old couple gets out. And the husband, who is a driver, obviously, <laughs> uh, looks at me. And obviously he sees my shirt and he kind of gives me a, sort of a dirty look. And I'm kind of like, dude, what's your problem, you know? And, and I kind of forget for, about a, for a few seconds that I'm wearing a t-shirt that says... Only God can judge me. Obviously, he did not. I guess he looked at my shirt, looked at me, and just obviously had you know some sort of thought in his head, going like, probably th probably thinking something like, "Yeah, a guy like you should be wearing a shirt like that." But really, I mean, in this town, people just don't want to give you a chance, especially the churchgoers. And I think I've covered this before, but I just want to I just want to kind of bring this up again. See, the thing is. People in this town think that, that just because they go to church and they donate to their church and everything like that, you know, they're holier than now and better than everybody else. But they're not. Because what they don't realize is that what you're given to the church is going into the pockets of the preachers. So, sad but true, but it's the truth. Because how often have you gone to a church, then you hear your preacher's on vacation somewhere in, like, say, another country. Or on a cruise ship in the Caribbean or something like that. I mean, come on. Seriously? These people want to judge somebody like me because the way I dress and the way I and, and a t-shirt I wear, not wearing it ironically, just wearing it because, you know, it was the first time I got a chance to wear it because I've had that shirt for about a year and I thought, why not wear it on a Sunday? It felt like a Sunday kind of shirt. But then this guy just looks at me and just, obviously, he's, he's, he's just sitting there kind of going like, yeah, somebody like you wearing a t-shirt like that, you shouldn't be. You really shouldn't need church. Folks, God and I, we're cool. We've been cool for a long, long time. I don't need church, and I don't need to be hanging around these, these God-fearing, church-going hypocrites. Because there's a lot of them around this town. There's tons of them around this town. But I say this much. If somebody who goes to a church feels like they have every right to judge you, I just tell them, just tell them that. Just tell them those five words. Hey, man, only God can judge me. You, your judgment, your disapproval, not needed. Thanks anyway. Get on your little church, give money to the preacher to put in his pocket so he can take it with him on his vacation to who knows where, and you can sit there feeling like an idiot because you thought it was actually going to the church or to the, or to the good Lord himself. Sorry, folks, that's not how it goes. So, yeah. So, to the churches of this world, man, I mean, there are some good church-going people. I've met them. They've never really been that judgmental of me. But to those who think they know better than everybody else and they're holier than now, <laughs> yeah, stick it where the sun don't shine, okay? God knows me. God knows me better than anybody. And well, several other people know me pretty well, too. So, you know, when it comes to people like my parents, my wonderful, beautiful wife, Sarah, good Lord above, and my, and my good friends, my best friends, however they feel about me, positive or negative, it's cool. But a complete stranger who goes to church and thinks that they have every right to judge somebody because they don't know them. Sorry, man. But uh, your, your, your judgment of me, not necessary. And others. I can't speak on behalf of others, but if you feel the same way, let me know in the comments below about what you feel about people like this. So, gang, I'm about a block away from the library. I'm going to get on out of here and go get this bad boy uploaded. Thanks for watching, everybody. God bless you all. And if you like my videos, please feel free to subscribe. Until next time, hope you're having an awesome day. Hope you guys have a great weekend, too. Try to be safe this Memorial Day weekend, okay? <laughs> Until next time, as always, stay strong and rock on.